and actual combat. These maneuvers are neither stunts nor daring feats, but a refinement of basic techniques taught to every prospective naval aviator. Here in San Francisco, California, we will demonstrate these maneuvers at very low altitude in traditional Blue Angel formation so that you may see and take pride in the precise fashion in which your Navy and Marine Corps pilots are trained to fly. Having completed their takeoff maneuvers at San Francisco International Airport, the six demonstration pilots have run them into the Delta formation. In this formation, the two solo pilots have joined in the left and right output positions on the way to the clinic early in the slot. As they approach, I would like to take this opportunity to introduce the six pilots who will be watching this afternoon. Ladies and gentlemen, flying Blue Angel number one, the commanding officer of the flight leader of the Blue Angels from Atlanta, Georgia, Captain Greg McWhorter. Flying Blue Angel number two, the right wingman from Orange Park, Florida, Lieutenant Commander Jim Tomaszewski. Flying Blue Angel number three, the left wingman, our Marine Corps representative in the Delta Formation from Knoxville, Tennessee, Major Brett Stevens. Smoke on. Flying Blue Angel number four, the slot pilot from Statesville, North Carolina, Lieutenant Rob Curley. Flying Blue Angel number five, the Insula from Reading, Pennsylvania, Lieutenant Commander Ben Walwar. Flying Blue Angel number six, the opposing Insula from Coon Rapids, Minnesota, Lieutenant C.J. Simonson. As the Delta approaches, you should put a minute on the entire political formation prior to individual fight with a solo maneuver. And now, right behind you, the Blue Wing comes to life. Diamond roll. 
all four aircraft rolling as one in this graceful 360 degree rolling maneuver.
Michael Wingman, Lieutenant Commander Tomaszewski, and Major Stevens still maintain that minimum wingtip to canopy separation. The flight leader and slot powder are both upside down. From the right, the Blue Angel double far more. formation. Approaching center point, Captain McWhorter will roll the formation 360 degrees into the 3D. During this extremely difficult maneuver, Lieutenant Curley on the outpost position will experience four times the displacement generated by Captain McWhorter's aircraft. Ladies and gentlemen, the Blue Angel left echelon roll. Right. Let's watch as the three wings smoothly shift back into the full angle 
formation. Still maintaining the minimum separation. The pilots who's now aligned themselves by this is 90 degrees from their flight path toward Chet McClure's aircraft. Experiencing heavy G, they will climb straight up into the vertical as they perform the very difficult five-plane line of rest loop. Over here.
it to the vertical. He will roll the formation 90 degrees and commence a moving maneuver. Walmart and Lieutenant Simonson are approaching to demonstrate the socially and LA characteristics of the 